The State University of New York at Buffalo presents a UB Athletics production of Men's Tennis Bulls Update. My name is Paul Peck, and for the latest on the men's tennis team, we welcome in UB head coach Lee Nickel, who's got his team ready to get going. You are off uh, to Dartmouth this weekend for the start of the spring season. Tell me what's going through your mind right now. Oh, well, just uh, a little nervous. Uh, we've we've had the guys back here for a couple days, uh, you know, but we going into Dartmouth knowing they're a top 35 level team, it's uh, it's going to be a good test, um, you know, but we're just trying to get the rust off right now and just get ready to go compete. Do you like starting off with such a high caliber opponent love it love it last year we caught cornell uh when they were around the same level uh and we, we took them out four three I, I think it's uh it's good to to go in and, and test ourselves right away right how how ready are your guys or is that what you're gonna find out <laughs> well we're we need a little bit more practice uh we do they're a little rusty um the guys did a good job of competing a good bit over the the break but uh, you know, we're just trying to get past the soreness of getting back into lifting weights and, and, and practicing and everything else. And But they look pretty solid. Right. And some pleasant news for you coming just within the last week or so. A new addition to your team, transfer from Central Florida, Amari Romick. Tell us a little bit about him. Yeah, Amar uh, was, was someone we recruited initially uh, when he was going to school. And, uh, you know, he went to UCF, which is a very good program, very well coached. Uh, but, uh, you know, now he's, uh, he decided to transfer and we're lucky enough to, to grab him. He's up here in Buffalo now and, uh, today's his first day he can practice. So we're excited to see what he's got. Right. Um, it'll take him a little while before you'll start using him in, in the matches. Sure. Sure. Hopefully we're still waiting, uh, to make sure everything goes through with the registrar, but he's, he's allowed to practice with the team. Uh, he's allowed to get into it. You know, he, he played two for him last year, uh, and one doubles. He was top 50 in the country in doubles for a while. Uh, so, you know, with an already uh, a veteran team that we have, he's going to be a great addition. All right, so with his addition and, like you said, with the veterans you have coming back, give me an idea of what your expectations are for this season. We're, we want to be top 50 in the country. That's, a, that's always a goal for us, and uh, our, our next goal is to, to win the MAC title. Uh, we feel like, you know, this is the year. We've got Damian David, uh, who is the reigning MAC player of the year. He's a senior. Uh, Sebastian Ionescu, again, who's a senior as well. These are two really, really good players for us and really good leaders. And uh, we owe it to them to, to close it out and finally get to the NCAA tournament. How much does your team take its cues, particularly from Damian and Sebastian? Uh, a good bit. You know, those guys, they, they aren't the most vocal leaders, I'd say. Uh, they lead by example. Uh, Damian's just a guy that will go out there and when he's on court and when he's working out, he's, he's, he's into it. Uh, same with Sebi. Sebi's a little bit more vocal, um, but he has really done a great job this year of stepping up into more of a leadership role. Uh, Damien's more of the quiet guy. Uh, you know, he's a, he's the kind of guy that you can legitimately take his racket away for two months and he'll come back and be at the same exact level that he was before. <laughs> so he's not going to sit there and beg to practice and, and get out there. But when he's out there, he's locked in and he's good. All right. Well, your first home meet or home matches come up on the 13th mm -hmm. of February against Niagara. We'll talk plenty more about that and get a good chance and find out how things went for you at Dartmouth when we get together next week. Mm -hmm. As always, for the latest on Lee Nickel and the men's tennis team, you can check social media and ubbowls.com.